Hi, hi community. Hi everyone. It's Christian again. So as you listen, this is going to be an English video. And um, first of all, I want to say sorry if you listen from me some bad word spelled. So I am not a natural speaker and natural English speaker, but I am sure you that I am going to do my best. So let's start. Um, now I want to present you some service that I want to expose to all the community as a contribution. Um, in the past uh, three months ago, maybe I was reading in the forum officially of about Power Automate that some users need something to extract links from a mail that they received. So I decided to make a service. So this is the service as you read here is a link extractor. So what this service do? So please let me show you in Power Automate. So I'm going to open or Power Automate and I'm going to start building this flow from the start, from the beginning. So we are going to open a new flow. So this flow is going to be off. So let me let me turn off this flow. Okay, it's turn off right now. Uh, turn on. Let me say turn off. Okay, it's turn off, and then I'm going to create a new one. So new automated, and then this could be link, and the trigger is going to be Outlook, Outlook service, and Outlook service, and is when a new email arrives, when a new email arrives here and create. Then I'm going to use my inbox folder and for in the next step, I'm going to add an HTTP action. Remember that these kind of actions are premium and requires an, an special license. So because are premium, so please be careful about that. And my service, what um, the service do, so is um, use a post method and then the URI or the URL that you are going to need here are the URL of my service. So this is this URL. I'm going to copy it and then here you are going to complete it with send.php. So yes, my service is was made it in PHP. So now I need to complete the headers. So the headers I have the headers here and the content type is going to be oh let me see just here I'm going to copy this and I'm going to pass it here because it's going to be an URL encode. So as this kind of service is going to receive a URL encode, I need to pass in the body the parameter set pagina and then equals to or content in HTML from a new email. So uh, because it's URL encode, I need to add an expression that is URL encode URI component. So I'm going to use encode URI component to transform my data that could be in a right format to my service. So I am going to use this encode URI component and then inside I'm going to pass my body um, my body property from, my, from the email that I'm going to receive in a few minutes. So this is everything. It's um, too quickly to to set up so I'm going to test my service um, here I'm going to wait to my email so I'm going to use another email that could be from here so a new email and then I'm going to send it to power 
automate arroba cristianabata.com and then this is going to be a mail mail with links and here in my content imagine that some someone sends you some links here like uh, see my profile profile and then in a kind of link it's going to send um, maybe a LinkedIn profile for example here I'm going to copy this this link and then as link here I'm going to add it into my email so I have one link into my email I'm going to do another search for example in Google um, that com about something else like uh, top three power automate updates it's just an example so I'm going to to copy this link and then in my email again I'm going to add it so links to top three power automate updates and then my link here's my link okay so I am going to send two links from an email to my power automate service so I'm going to click on send and then in my power automate flow so I'm going to see that first I received my my email with links and in a few seconds so here is uh, my trigger is um, getting my response so it's starting because I received an email so when an email arrives it starts my trigger and then this is going to pass to my service and my service returned me just the links without any content in HTML that has my email so remember my email always returns me in the body property all of the content in HTML and my service what um, the service do is just get only the links that are in the mail content so um, as I told you I read a lot about this kind of functionality so I'm going to expose this service that I made I, I found um, quick lines of code in in github 2 so this is kind of uh, public so I'm going to decide to share with you this service that you can use by free so as um, an, an contribution uh, for the community so I hope this service could help you in the future um, thank you so much for watching me um, this is the second video that I that I do speaking in English I hope I could be I could do um, my best work so speaking in English and it's it's all <laughs> um, thank you so much again to watch my videos and support me so see you in the next video maybe could be in English too. See you.